Is this thing working? Hello? Hey! Hey! Hello! Hello! Hey! What's up, monks? Monkey Tang here with the power of makeup. It was requested by a female monk. So, without further ado, the power of makeup. Hey guys, I'm here today to show you the power of makeup. Are I've you been noticing a lot? Are you here to show us this? Have been almost ashamed to say that they love makeup because nowadays when you say you love makeup you, you be either it? do it because you, you want like to look it, good for like boys it. you do it because you're insecure or you do it because you don't love yourself i feel like in a way lately it's almost a crime to love doing your makeup so after seeing last week's rupaul's drag race with the half drag half male i was inspired to show you the power of makeup i notice a lot that when i don't wear makeup and i have my hair up in a bun and i meet people and i show them pictures of my videos or or whatever looks i have done they look at me and straight up tell me that is not you they tell me that's funny because i don't even look like that girl on the picture so without any further ado i'm gonna do half my face full on glam. I'm truly going to transform one side of my face and the other side is going to be me. Raw, unedited, nothing, me. Just me. So let's do it. Today I'm first going in with my Kogan Do Aqua Foundation oh, in number are you? 213. It makes me look photoshopped without Photoshop. Photoshop that's, that's why I love it. The Photoshop. Same goes for concealer. I have dark circles. I want them to be gone. I love brows. Problem is, I don't have them naturally. What is the solution for that? Brow pencil. <laughs> Brow pencil. Eyes. I don't like how my eyes are hooded, slightly on the smaller side, and just not as open and awake and fresh. So I like to take a brown eyeshadow and start building in my crease. And most of the days, I don't even follow my natural crease. I just go a little bit above it and create this new shape so I can create this eye shape or the effect that I want my eye to give by using makeup. Here I'm using Anastasia Beverly Hills eyeshadow in Fawn and Cognac. Golds and taupe eyeshadows are my favorite for on the lid so for this transformation I'll use no other. I love optically making my eyes look larger. So for this, I'm taking my Cavani Tattoo Liner in Trooper and creating a new inner corner. And creating a parallel line underneath and leaving the space in between there. Smoke out the lower lash line as smoky as you want it to be. Hey, Marilyn and Monroe. to open up those inner corners even more, I'm taking this Jewel Effects in Shine by Makeup Studio and sparkle it up. Sparkle. See, I couldn't be a girl and do makeup. I couldn't be a guy and, and do makeup. And if there's one I'd thing that poke my eye out, I'd go blind. Up my eyes, it's eyeliner. See, right there. I would. Nope. I'd hurt myself. 
And of course, lashes. For this, I'm using the Lena lashes, and these are Bev. Now, fake eyelashes? Uh... One of the main things I get told when I show people a I don't know about of fake me eyelashes. with makeup, it's... like in my videos, and when I'm like without them. makeup in front of them in person, they always say, but you look so much slimmer. Let me introduce you to the world of contouring. Contouring is my religion. Contouring. So today, to sculpt one side of my face, I'll be using the Caffeine Shade and Light palette. Got a double chin? Contour that chit. <laughs> look at that, look at that. Cheekbones on point. Where is the point? Bronzer, because it gives me the sun without the damage. Luminosa blush by Milani, because it just transforms my cheeks into heaven. And the Balm's Mary Luminizer to highlight. For lips, I like lining them. Today I'm using Boldly Bear Lip Pencil by MAC just to give the shape of my lips a little bit more volume. Then a Pinky Curl Lipstick. This is Soft Touch by Dose of Colors. And over top, a Nude Gloss. Here I'm using the Rimmel Apocalypse Lip Lacquer in number 100. And that, guys, is the power of makeup. Wow. By no means, I want to say that if you have insecurities, that you should just slap makeup on, feel better, and just never be content with your own There's self. There's a whole lot of difference people to between know that makeup the right is and fun, left side. And there are no rules to makeup. And yes, and I'm looking at it from a turn. If you want to go turn, for that super ass shot contour for the day, do it. If you want to go for a red this lip is and her crazy bold right eyes, side with the makeup, do the left it. There side has are no, no rules to makeup, and makeup is there for I will say it definitely does make good. a difference in the way the person the looks with makeup, makeup or without makeup. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed but, this video, please give it a thumbs I mean, up and subscribe to my channel. I hope you enjoyed. Girls, and by all means, really don't if you need want to do to be a take on this, but half if you like face it, of nothing, half face, a full on that's glam, fine. by all means, do it. Tag me on Instagram and Twitter or Facebook, wherever. Tag me. And tag I want to thank you for watching. Bye bye. Now, like I was saying just a few seconds ago, you don't need makeup to be beautiful. You don't need makeup to help you feel beautiful. You're beautiful no matter what. Because, number one, the most important reason is you're made by God in the most perfect form. Because he's the one that made you. You're beautiful because he made you. Two... If you like makeup, that's cool. That's fine. If you want to make up yourself up, go ahead. That's fine. That's your deal. That's what you want to do. But take a look at these two pictures right here. This is my my beautiful fiance Chelsea without makeup. And this is my beautiful fiance Chelsea with makeup. See, either way you look at her, it doesn't matter. With or without makeup, she's beautiful 100%. Now, and that goes for every other girl out there. No matter what, you're beautiful 100%. But, I mean, if you want to use makeup, that's cool. If you don't want to use makeup, you don't have to. You don't have to have that to make yourself, make yourself feel beautiful. Some girls are like, oh my god, I need it so bad. No, you don't. And I'm not saying that I'm going to look at every girl and I'm like, oh my god, you're gorgeous. Oh my god, you're beautiful. Oh my god, no. I don't do that. But the simple fact of respect for my fiance, I don't look at other women that way. Because Chelsea is my fiance, we will be getting married next year. But there is beautiful women. Everyone, every woman is beautiful, no matter what. But 
it seems like a lot of women like to use makeup as a crutch. But just remember, all women, and my fiance included, you, you are beautiful no matter what people say. Whatever someone else says to you, do not let it get to you if it's negative. Just know you're beautiful and nothing can get in that way. Because the reason why you're beautiful is because God made you. And that's it. Remember to have a blessed day. Have a fun time doing it. And, and, thumbs up. Put a smile on that face. With or without makeup. It's up to you. There ain't nothing wrong with makeup. Just don't put it on me. Stay happy, guys. I'll see you in, 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 in the next video that I do. Bye, guys. Bye. Thank you.